I think that the biggest and most substantial element of scholarships, I will say, is that statement of support. The fact of having a scholarship changed my whole life, man. It really did. It gave me a certain push for me to leave home, go somewhere unknown, and figure out this dream that I always had of being an artist. I'm originally from the island of Puerto Rico. My family was very anxious, me as well. You know, arriving to the school, I confronted quickly a beautiful, diverse program of students from all over the world with different perspectives creatively. I did not come from a well-off family or a well-off area, so I don't think I would have been able to afford a school like this without financial support. I think it also kind of gave me the encouragement of knowing that I was capable of doing it and that people thought I could do it. I think having like support from donors is really encouraging, makes you feel like you belong in the community because you know that there's all these people who have come before you that are there to support you so that you can start and be a part of the community fully. Community for me is very important. Financial support can help me to believe I am doing something right. I am an experience-oriented creator. So all my work is focused on the disabled people and disabled community because my sister is suffer from the cerebral palsy. So this is important and meaningful for me. If you come from a place that doesn't have any financial support, that voice will not lend itself to that ecosystem of foreign fauna that's really essential. The scholarship that I received was a huge psychological relief. It validated my choice to be here, the risk that I took to get to this place so that kind of space that it opened up allowed me to think less about my survival and more about this internal creativity that was kind of exuding from me after I received that scholarship. One of the things that had kind of kept me postponing the process for 20 plus years was the financial implications. And so receiving this kind of assistance was instrumental to, to me making the decision to come back and do my graduate work. In addition to working as an artist, I'm also an educator and I see in my own students in the elementary setting that we don't teach explicitly enough creative thinking. And I think by contributing to more people in the world who are critical and creative thinkers, we just have more people in the world who can analyze and solve problems in new and different ways.